Desi is one of the leading research laboratories in Germany and one of the world leading accelerator centers. We build and operate large scale accelerator facilities which enable a broad range of scientific usage. Our approach of developing novel accelerator concepts is based on our experience in accelerator technology merged with entirely new ideas. One of the important aspects of novel accelerators will be to increase the accelerating gradient. That way the accelerators can become very compact and low cost. An example of such technologies is plasma acceleration, which we have uh, under development now and which is a very rapidly expanding field. The Tesla Technology Collaboration was the collaboration taking care of the development of the technology for large-scale superconducting accelerators. So in the Tesla Technology Collaboration, DAISY played a major role because we invited more than 25 years ago experts from all the world to join an effort to build first prototype accelerator modules. One since almost 20 years, the so-called flash facility, and since recent, the longest superconducting LINAC worldwide, the European XFEL. Building the longest superconducting LINAC worldwide was only possible in strong collaboration with partners. What DAISY offers to the community of accelerator builders is quite unique. We have all the infrastructure required to build superconducting accelerators. This starts with the quality control of the niobium, which is the material needed to build superconducting accelerating structures. But it also goes on with all the knowledge which is required to build superconducting modules under very clean conditions. FLAS is a free action laser user facility. FLAS has a superconducting LINAC and two antelator beam lines to produce SASE FE radiation. The two antelator beam lines, FLAS 1 and FLAS 2, are operated simultaneously. The wavelength range of FLAS is from extreme ultraviolet to soft X rays. Thanks to the superconducting technology, we can provide several thousands of photon pulses per second for user experiments. As a pioneering facility, FLAS started the user operation in summer 2005. It was the first SASE FEL worldwide providing XUV and soft X-ray radiation for user experiments. New accelerator technologies like plasma accelerators and accelerator on a ship are so promising because they have very high accelerating gradients, so they can be 1,000 times smaller than our conventional accelerators. Zinbad will be our dedicated accelerator research and development facility at DAISY. It will be used by the accelerator division, by the photon science division, the particle physics division, but also University Hamburg and our international collaborators. The Zinbad facility attracts young scientists from all over the world to Hamburg who are fascinated by our vision to shrink down particle accelerators by a factor of 1000. Then we can implant them, for example, into a human body and irradiate cancer cells in the body without hurting healthy tissue. In particular, we are funded by European Union for a big project called Eupraxia, where 40 institutes worldwide uh, are gathering to build a European plasma research accelerator. The Deluxe facility is a novel laser plasma accelerator. It has been developed over the last couple of years in a close collaboration of University of Hamburg and DESI. And what we're trying to do is here bring the technology of laser plasma acceleration one step further, going from proof of principle experiments towards actually making this a reliable technology. A major milestone that we achieved only last summer was the generation of first light from the beams. So we could demonstrate that we are not only able to generate these beams, but we can capture them transport them and then control them in a very precise way so that at the very end of our accelerator they generate first light. In Hamburg we really have a unique opportunity by combining university research with the knowledge, expertise, know-how and infrastructure of a big national accelerator lab and University of Hamburg and DAISY working together really is a game changer because we bring the best of both worlds together. The future development of DAISY as an accelerator laboratory I see mainly twofold. On the one side, we will keep on improving the performance of the existing facilities. On the other hand, we enter into a phase of designing entirely new 
accelerators based on novel concepts.